We have some breaking news to share on Stallion Discoveries. Very exciting. A few months in the making. Uh, they have just announced the uh, results from their VTEM survey from last uh, winter. Uh, that data has being, uh, was being poured over. And uh, just today, they have released their, um, their reaction uh, to the survey results. And I wish to jump into that press release that you can find on stalliondiscoveries.com. Uh, I encourage you to kick over there and look at what Stallion is doing. Stallion is a fly under the radar uh, company that is looking to make a big land discoveries, big uh, uranium and gold uh, discoveries specific to this announcement up in the Athabasca Basin, this western Athabasca on Stallion Discoveries property, which is boasting one of the largest uh, land packages in the Athabasca for uh, uranium production, which is the most prolific region in all of the world. We want to highlight some of the um, particulars of the survey results, uh, what they were able to find and the results uh, reaction from Stallion Discoveries that they have shared with the public facing audience. With some things to take away from the report, I want you guys to understand that since technology has improved so much over time, these reports are worth their weight in uranium. The, the, the methods by which they go to make these discoveries is much more advanced than they have ever done in the past, which gives them a, a much clearer idea of what type of areas to strategically focus on. And Stallion has opted for those uh, commencements in the fall for strategic drilling um, on the property itself. So really exciting news coming forward from Stallion, and I thought that I would share those forward uh, with you guys. So without further ado, let's jump in and take a look at the particulars of the news announcement that just hit the wire just today. A news release has just hit the wires on Stallion Discoveries. You can find it on stalliondiscoveries.com, but uh, I thought it uh, prudent to pay forward some of the details in their uh, summary from their large survey on their uh, western Athabasca Basin. For those of you guys who don't know who Stallion Discoveries is, Stallion owns uh, one of and flirting with one of the largest um, land packages in the Athabasca region. They are a true player in the space. Um, they are uh, within uh, neighboring distance of some of the who's who up in the Athabasca uh, going after uranium deposits and one of the most prolific uh, uranium deposits in the world. And this is a conclusion or at least um, a summary that we have been waiting for on uh, the VTAM data survey that was uh, announced a few months ago and turned out. But this is the actual release from Stallion Discoveries in what they are um, able to share through the public facing forum. Uh, some of the results of that survey. And so for you guys that um, are interested, kick over to Stallion Discoveries and read the report yourself. But I'm going to highlight uh, some of what was released here on behalf of Stallion. Uh, Stallion is pleased to announce the results on key projects from the 5200 line kilometer VTEM uh, plus survey completed last winter. Okay, so we've had this book uh, on the books for a while. Uh, but it needed to be interpreted, and this release is the um, is the release that discusses just that. The data was provided to Condor Consulting, Condor, uh, to complete advanced processing of the VTAM data in combination with compiled historical data. The results include conductor picking, target prioritization, and advanced magnetic processing of the new data and integrating the historical magnetic data. The company is also outlining their fall and winter exploration plans for its western Athabasca Basin uranium project. Stallion is very pleased with the results, which dem demonstrates multiple areas that are responding similarly to the F3 uranium's junior zone and uranium Energy Corporation's Shea Creek deposits. The regional electromagnetic survey successfully identified several prospective areas across the Stallion's projects with significant uh, discovery potential. 
That's the key. And that's what we were waiting for. The EM anomalies identified by Condor will uh, be followed up on with ground EM survey this fall. Along with the EM data, the advanced processing of the magnetic data identified multiple structural complexities as well as coincident magnetic lows, which have been known to represent uranium alteration. The company will begin delineating these areas and advancing them for Stallion's maiden drill program. Four target zones have been identified to be followed up with. Uh, exploration in the fall and winter uh, projects are untested with drilling and have the potential opportunity to host undiscovered uranium corridors. These additional targeted surveys will give Stallion the best opportunity to intersect uranium mineralization with drilling in the winter. In addition, Stallion plans to complete a regional inducive, inductive passive EM survey over the Stallion um, Atha JV project looking to extend uh, existing conductive corridors onto this new frontier of exploration in the western Athabasca. Uh, quoting, identifying these several highly prospective target areas across Stallion's large land package gives us a strong opportunity to discover the next significant uranium deposits in the basin stated Drew Zimmerman, Chief Executive Officer. Historically, our land package was largely overlooked, but with the new mining methods and technologies continuing to be developed, our projects are now becoming extremely relevant for future uranium exploration as the uranium market continues to strengthen. Tied to ongoing concerns over future uranium supply, we believe that this market provides the right conditions for uranium exploration at the scale stallion uh, that has planned for the coming year. As a team, we are incredibly excited about what lies ahead in the coming months, end quote. That was Drew Zimmerman, uh, the CEO of um, Stallion Discoveries. So that's his, his highlight and just a, a, a fantastic news release here um, highlighting the, um, the results of the VTEM data. Um, we'll look to have Drew on as a guest of the channel. We just wanted to push this out through the channel and make sure folks are aware that these guys are um, hold a significant land package in one of the most prolific uh, areas in all of the world in the western Athabasca Basin. And these results uh, do in fact provide us some clarity on how prolific uh, this these deposits could be actually on the Stallion Discoveries properties. So with that, guys, we will kick you back and we'll conclude the video. So we've come out of the review of the Stallion Discoveries press release on their Ath Western Athabasca uh, VTEM survey results. Very exciting. It's going to be incredible to see how these um, these results actually lend itself to uh, further identification of their uh, strategic drill program uh, in the fall. Uh, Drew Zimmerman, he's pleased with the results as disclosed through the release, and it's going to be incredible to see what Stallion does with this now that they know uh, what they're working with. So uh, for anybody out there that uh, is interested in the Stallion uh, Discovery story, please visit stalliondiscoveries.com. Uh, you'll find this latest news release and much, much more uh, on the history of the company and what they're looking to do. And an under the radar company is building one of the largest land packages in all of the Athabasca Basin, going after uranium with the shift in energy and the shift in energy consciousness and the green uh, push for lower carbon solutions. Uranium is right in everybody's radar and Stallion Discoveries looks to benefit from that. Guys, I appreciate you tuning in. If you enjoy the content, subscribe to the channel. Leave your comments at the bottom of this video. Uh, hit the notification bell. I appreciate you holding with me for the totality of the video and good luck in your investment future.